In this video, I'm going to show you how to install a keyboard on your phone, which will make you appear smarter. Hi, this is Justin from Simply Smart, where we make smart home technology as easy as one, two, three. So if you're interested in smart home technology, consider subscribing for more content like this. Also check out the video description for the three simple steps to building your ultimate smart home. Now in this video, what we're gonna be doing a little bit different today, we're just gonna be showing you an app on a phone. If you have ever commented on any of my videos, you'll know that you always get a response. I respond to every single comment. So I do a lot of typing on my phone. So I need it to be able to be fast and accurate. So I downloaded this keyboard and it makes a huge difference. So let's go into the app store and what we're going to be downloading, it's called Grammarly right here. And it's the one on the top here is the Grammarly keyboard. So you just want to download that. And then once it's downloaded, you can just go ahead and open it. And that's just going to tell you that basically, you know what it does. So basically anytime you type on your phone, you can use the Grammarly keyboard and it will make sure that you're typing everything correctly and automatically fix things that are problems. So we're just going to tap on next. If you tap on a word, it's going to give you a synonym for that word. So if you wanted to change it quickly with a tap, and it's also going to do a better word predictions for you as well. And it also works in all of your apps. So anytime you're at, you know, typing in any app, you can use the Grammarly keyboard. And I also use it on like my desktop. Um, I have like it on everything that I use word, everything. So you are going to need an account for this. Now it is completely free now there, and there are paid accounts that you can do as well. So if you don't have an account, you just want to sign up. I do have an account, so I'm just going to log in and I just use the free account. And once you sign in, it's going to ask you if you want to pay for something. Um, I don't pay for it, um, but these are the prices here if you did want to pay for this. So I'm just going to tap the X at the top. And now what you want to do is add the Grammarly keyboard into your phone. I'm going to show you um, how to do that here. I'm just going to tap on add Grammarly keyboard at the bottom right here. So it's going to take you over to the Grammarly app settings. Just go into keyboards and turn on Grammarly and also turn on allow full access and allow. So now if we go back, now if we go down to our general settings, this is an iPhone, but they do have an Android version as well. And we go down to keyboards and we go up to keyboards here. You have Grammarly keyboard and it's right here. So we know that it is installed and um, ready to use. All right, so now if we go say into our text messages, and I'm just going to send a text message to myself and I've already created a text message with some mistakes. And at the bottom, you just wanna click on the world and now it has switched over to our Grammarly keyboard. So what it's gonna do is it's going to look at the text above and it's going to fix all of these issues. So otherwise what you'd have to do is you have to go up into the text, type things and fix things. And a lot of the things may slip slip through the cracks too. And it's also giving you some tips here, tap to apply or swipe to ignore the suggestion. So I'm actually gonna tap on the green G on the left, and this is revision mode. So basically it's going to go through your text and it's gonna look for any problems. So I'm gonna tap continue. And it's saying that thanks should be thank. It shouldn't be thanks you. It should be thank. So all we have to do is tap and it will fix that problem. Watching is spelled wrong. So I'm going to tap this and you can see it corrected that. It's saying that there's two fours. So I'm gonna delete one of those just by tapping. There's two A's, so we're gonna tap that, but the critical issues are corrected. So I can just go back and I can put a period there. So you can see that that was super easy to um, you know, correct those errors without having to go back into your text, delete, backspace, type new stuff. It just finds them for you. You tap it and, it's, and it corrects it. So that is much easier than going back in there. And I can send that message to myself. So that is now sent. 
So also if I type something in here, so it didn't find any errors or they would pop up at the bottom here. So it's saying that you made writing look easy, so that's good. And it would also show in the bottom. So if you tap on a word, I tapped on making, and then you can see that it gives you all these synonyms. So if I tap on making, then I can instantly re replace making with creating, just like that. And then if I don't like creating, I could say developing, cultivating. See how easy that is to just replace a word. So sometimes you're typing something and you're like, man, I don't know what the word is that I'm looking for, or that doesn't sound quite right. So then you could type here and I could replace videos with tapes. Or if I don't like tapes, I could change it back to videos, just like by tapping right on the suggestion at the bottom. So as you can see, the Grammarly keyboard is just an awesome addition to any phone. It's going to help you write better. Um, even if you're like a younger um, student in school or something like that, you can type something in and see if Grammarly gives you any suggestions. So that can definitely help out um, your kids at school. And it definitely helps out every time I respond to all of your guys' comments. So I hope you found that video helpful. If you did, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. And I will see you in the next video.